bit of a rough start, five and nine, but you've regrouped. I think in the last 11 games, you're seven and four. What's been the turnaround for you guys? What happened? Well, we just come together and uh, been more focused and more committed to what we're trying to do as a unit. You know, uh, it's it's easy to go out there and play, and each individual just get their own statistics but it, it's to win the game uh, you have to be a group that's playing to win you have to have a purpose and everybody's on the same page with that purpose offensively and defensively and along those lines you guys are three and a half games into the playoffs now if you make that push to make the playoffs what do you have to do well we just have to keep winning I think that's important uh, you know we've gotten down you know five six games under 500 we're two under now and if we get over 500 and keep winning it just puts pressure on the teams that are ahead of us are trying to get there with us to continue winning and uh, you know one thing about the NBA is that uh, the teams that have winning records uh, usually aren't losing five or six in a row so you got to win five or six yourself lose one win five or six in order to, to stay right there. You mentioned uh, having guys not focus on individual stats, but Zach Randolph, 20 points, 13 boards, he's been a beast this year. Yeah, he has been a beast, but uh, you know, it's not focusing on individual stats. When I say that, it's not so much focusing, focusing on individual stats, it's just about going out and, and everybody just playing their own game. It's got to be a Memphis Grizzly game, and uh, Zach has played the Memphis Grizzly game, and offensively he's done the yeoman's work in the post and on offensive glass, and he's rebounded. And uh, you know we're we're getting into a groove that we had last year where we just went out and we played our game, and uh, you know teams had to had to really concentrate hard to stop us. And Marcus all coming on and having a big game the other night really sets us up for. Uh, uh, you know, uh, going to this stretch of getting to the All-Star game because we need everybody in order to, uh, to reach our goals. One more question there, Coach. Mike Conley, you've coached him for a couple of years now. He seems to come and get really confident this year and have some of his best basketball of his career. Talk about his growth you've seen from him this season. Well, that's it, confidence and uh, I think, it, you know, getting stronger. But, you know, he's got a ways to go. He's got to get bigger and stronger. And he's a tough little guy, but, you know, when you're bigger and stronger, you don't take the licks. Uh, you know the way he has to take them now and you can dish some out uh, and I just think you know being aggressive uh, confident player knowing that you're good knowing that you can compete with everybody that you go up against and then going out and doing it because at that point guard spot every night you know there's a the top flight point guard that you have to go and compete against and you have to have confidence that you're one of them. Thanks coach.